Greetings, my friends, and Merry Christmas. I pray your Christmas was a blessed and joy-filled one. Today, today's readings is from the second chapter of Luke, starting with verse 36. We hear about the prophetess, Anna. In a world that was so focused on the male, we have here a woman who is held up as a model of perseverance and quiet holiness. Here is a woman whose husband died only seven years after they were married. Some would be angry at God or blame God, but not Anna. She also lived to be 84, a long life in days where most people at these times only lived to be 40 or 50 years old. But she never gave up. She never gave up hope to see the child who would be the redemption of Jerusalem. How did she find such devotion to God, filled with hope? We hear in today's gospel that she prayed and worshiped God without ceasing. She remained in God's house, the temple, and she fasted. What perseverance and an awareness of God's presence in her life. And God rewarded her with the presence and knowledge of the child Jesus and the salvation he brings to the people of Jerusalem. In yesterday's reading, we read that Mary and Joseph in the normal tradition of presenting the child Jesus in the temple, hear the words of Simeon about the child. Very special words. Today, we hear about Anna, who even though a prophetess, but we don't hear her quoted like Simeon. It is almost like her quiet, holy nature confirms Simeon's blessing, a woman of devotion and holiness. I hope that this beautiful reading tells us that some are called to be bold and speak out about God, but some are called to a quiet reverence through their actions of prayer, fasting, and worship. They come to know God and express God's meaning. And we add, I hope that this Christmas finds blessings on all of you, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Amen.